At least until February. <laughs> That's your resolution. Hello, everyone. Yeah. Welcome to Let's Get On With It Late Shift, a high stakes, full motion video crime thriller. Uh, choices matter, interactive cinematic experience, and these choices gotta come quick if they're gonna come at all. It is Corporate Grimace's mandated responsibility, though, to fob choices onto others. And uh, in lieu of a chuckle fuck democracy, I have Lethal Feline. How you doing? And the mysterious JJ. Hello. This is a game I had an eye on for a while, but I never pulled the fucking trigger for it. I ended up getting from Freezies for someone who was burdened by too many humble choice games. So Mechanical Unicorn, shout out to you. Now when you say choices make a difference, we're not talking different colored explosions in the ending scene. This is like real game will be driven by our choices territory. As far as I'm aware, yes, you have a, a choice on the left, a choice on the right, and no choice if the timer expires. Uh, Lethal Feline's familiar with that in Cyberpunk 2077, because some of that happens with V. <laughs> Here's our option screen. I've done a little bit of sound testing and audio balancing. Uh, our music may end up flaring too loud, but it was important that everyone is able to enjoy that. It's important to hear Cunt Waffle McGee Pro Tag in his monologuing. Hopefully he gets louder. He will. Okay. Late shift. Left, right, and center choices. I hope we get libertarian and socialist choices, too. Control movie. Banshone. Soon. <laughs> Und soon. Topeka, Kansas. Some people say you're committed. All part of some bigger picture. I'm leaning some in trying to hear. harmonious flow, endless and meaningful. Maybe that's how it looks from a distance. But up close, with eyes open, I see no evidence open. of any spiritual choreographer at work. No, I see nothing but the random fractals of a selfish, queenless hive. Never looking. Never stopping. Never meeting. Really? Don't get me wrong, yeah? I'm not judging anyone. I mean, I want to get home as fast as the next person. But is it my unwavering selflessness that allows others to go before me? Or the selfish knowledge that the last one will be the first off? Okay, this is our first choice thing. We're going to be selfish, or are we going to be selfish? I'm going for selfish. But is the choice to be selfless or selfish, or are we choosing why we think he let other people on the... Uh, all right, this is already going to be great with, like, hive minds. Maybe I should just fob off, like, choices. Or, like, <laughs> like, bullet boy, lethal. <laughs> lethal. Selfish, go. <laughs> uh, selfish, yeah. Okay. I mean, someone is always going to end up standing right by the door. I'm just good at making sure it's me. You, Roy. Like it or not, life's a sinister competition, an endless series of choices, large or small, each with a set of probabilities. Got that was choice. No, that is an 80% chance this is my train. It's worth a dash. Excuse me. Uh, this train Random variables. Street. Never underestimate the human What you factor. got, JJ? Bond Street. Bond Street is on your platform. Thank you. Not sure how that followed from help, but okay. Well, I guess I told him the answer to his question, which I couldn't hear clearly. And, and, and then he didn't pile drive you. And of course, saying nothing to me would also be a choice. Just say, fuck you, I ain't doing shit. <laughs> oh, I'm muting at that point in that case. Yeah. You guys in 30 minutes. I, I continue to get achievement progress. Thanks for tracking that game. Well, the snowman. <laughs> I think it's different. We, think it's we got her. We got Ferraris driving by, okay. It's Rudy Giuliani. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's looking pretty good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, the hair dye's not training down his head today. Right. Right. There's two cars out. The rest are logged. Should be a nice, quiet night. See you tomorrow. The milk yeah, run. Will it be a quiet night? You choose. In just a few seconds. Never leave Booth. 
I want to close the locker or leave it open since no one's going to come in here and get at it anyway. I've been there before. I know what that's like. And here they are. The most meaningful relationship I've ever had in my life. I've also been there before too. A bunch of metal windows. <laughs> me and my right hand. My beauty. You could keep me in college for over a decade. Seems like an easy way to lose a very, not very good job. It's not even that great a car, to be honest. The I8. Oh yeah, no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. If somebody offered me that car, I'd be like, "Fuck it, that's what you find." I'll take the Camry instead. Fuck you. Ah, here he is. Did you put all wrongdoers to flight? Uh, you can leave the keys to me, sir. I'll park the car for you. I'm not the driver, son. Well, I do beg your pardon, madam. No problem. Well, he no spouted problem. off. I mean, Tim or her? Fuck. Thank you. you Which we'd rather fuck? I'd say so her. Small, you don't even see them. You are your decisions, that's what shapes you. And that last one shaped me into a little bit of a chauvinist. Just it's like good. that pig in a suit. Don't hurt it's you too much, mate. Okay, it's we'll get our, over it. It's not our fault. We didn't yeah, make that guy, choice. The guy started choice. talking at us. She was being quiet. Another piece of shit car. Look at that crappy thing. How'd they get the keys for that? We didn't give them to them. I read from left to right or right to left. Choose. Oh. Forget something. Not exactly. Um, I'm sorry about before. You know, just assuming like that. Oh, ignore him. He was being an arsehole. I think your boyfriend's an arsehole. <laughs> Don't you? You're just assuming he's my boyfriend yeah. now. He does have a nice car. What are you reading? Just a little bit of light study. Looks <laughs> pretty heavy to me. <sighs> pretty heavy score. Uh, I need a favor. I need the keys to the Maserati. Mmm. Mmm. Of course he does. Well, she's hot, and it's a video game and not real life, so sure. Then you want my sign for it then? Okay, he doesn't know. It's a secret, but I really need those keys. Mmm. It's just for tonight. I'll be back before two. Uh-huh. What are we doing, Lethal? Go for one? <laughs> We're not answering at all. I want to see what happens. Sometimes there are only bad choices. <laughs> even indecision has consequences. Come on. It's a simple answer. Yes or no? JJ. Say indecision. Okay. Yeah, give her the fucking keys. We should have asked her why, but... Fine. I didn't. Like I, I wasn't able to get to yes in time. <laughs> oh, excellent. I win anyway. <laughs> we couldn't anyway. get to yes. <laughs> the negotiations have failed. Game over. <laughs> Try being more interesting next time. JG had to give a wind up. <laughs> Unlocked achievement. This isn't a very interesting right, game. Uh, go to check. All right. I got to that time. <laughs> Calling the police, that's no fun. Let's do it ourselves. We'll take our handy-dandy scanner. <laughs> we gotta jump on these choices faster. No more editorializing. Save the chatter for when there's no choice on screen. I think the right choice here isn't Slowly. to check or call the police. It's just to sit in your booth and do nothing. Now get over it. Drop it. What are we doing, JJ? Drop it. He's got a fucking gun. Oh. <laughs> now get in the car. Uh, which car, sir? <laughs> Oi, dickhead. Oh, the camera. Does it look like I can drive? Yes. You get behind the wheel. You have one working hand, my dude. Always drive you out of here. That's exactly what you're gonna do. Let's have something wrong with his feet. Well, the stick shift is on the right side. He wants to be respectful and not drive with his forearm. I mean, oh, he's that, in the UK. Yeah, you're right. Ah. 
I'm not sure if the I-8 has a manual transmission. It's probably auto because it's a part electric. What are we doing? Right. Right. Go, go, go. Move, move, move. Uh -huh. well, he, he sat in the car. Now's the time to run. <laughs> Throw away your pepper spray and run. Choices matter, achievement progress. Thank you, video group. The acting in this is better than I expect in a, you know, full motion game. I can never tell if acting is any good when they have accents. They always sound like they're good actors. <laughs> what the fuck, Jason? Just... <laughs> I'm a fucking student. Okay, I've got no money. My family's got no money. I'm worth nothing to you. You done now? Get in the house. KJ. Do it. He's got a gun. You know, just want to make sure. No, and it's like, yeah, I, I'm explaining my rationale. Yep, my which, for you. most of these things, is a guy with a gun is telling you to do it. Apparently, you are now his chauffeur. Just want to make sure I look And I want to make sure we have a bunch of Where's Butler? We, we wronged him, and it was a Seinfeld scenario. It's the night guard. What happened to your arm? He fell 15 feet onto a concrete floor. This is your idea of a slick operation. Dripping DNA all over the place, kidnapping the first innocent bystander. Fall 15 feet and you know what happens? You cut open your hand. Jesus Christ. Oh. And who the hell's gonna mm. drive? Because you're clearly not. I'll be all right. Fucking idiot. Hey, it has Here's to our be payday fun. operation. No way you can manage the auction assistant and everyone downstairs on your own. I'm well aware of how many people it has to be. You have to call it off. Do you want to tell Mr. Wu that we missed the one chance to go out? I can't imagine where this is going. We have one window of opportunity and we're going to use it. Fine. Eminem told Ow. me about this once. Leave him to bleed. We need to make some calls and try and find a replacement in the next... Shit, in the next 30 minutes, call Danny if he doesn't pick up. Try and get hold of that you know, Irish Pete. <sighs> Irish Pete whiskey. What about him? <laughs> Let's put a bullet in him. I don't care. People? Hey, contradict! Look, I, I don't know who you guys are or what you're up to, okay? I'm not I can drive. To anyone. Well, it's not going to take you long to figure it out, is it? Well, no, not if you keep talking in front of me, it won't. It'll be on the news, smarter. I'm not a murderer. I don't intend to start now. Pass me Diffinoxin and a couple of cable ties. JG? Steal away. Or press. You stay where you are. Look, you said you wouldn't hurt me. No, I said I wouldn't kill you. That still leaves lots of painful options. Make a suggestion. Not good at maths, are you, mate? What's that supposed to mean? Minus one, plus one. I make zero. Yeah, zero problems. Look, you need someone to help you out. And I need someone not to stick a fucking syringe in me. Why on earth would I trust you? Because you don't have a choice. Just like I don't. But we've had multiple choices. See your point. They matter. Are you are you going to go to the basement? We've got no idea who he is. After tonight, we're not going to see him again. What difference does it make? The difference is this guy looks like trouble. Well, Mr. Wu is trouble, and we've made a deal with him we can't go back on. Mr. Wu! What do you say? I don't care who does what, as long as I get my cut. Man of my own heart. You better not fuck this up. That's shareholder lethal right there. Mm-hmm. What about the money? <laughs> don't push your look. Right? Yeah, I, I wouldn't probably... Push it. <laughs> no, push it. Push it. Push it. Lethal's right. So I want to share. Fuck off. Shut up. Shareholder. <laughs> of okay, I tell you what. You just split fifty-fifty. That's the deal. Done. Hey, because that's more than nothing. It's done. It's done. Fair share, okay. you, but good work. It's done, Paul. You're joking. We'll find you something. The thing is, they could just tell us we're getting money and then kill us. So you know, what's it to them? We have a verbal contract now, JJ. <laughs> <laughs> these guys look like they're spoken. <laughs> these guys are all about following law. <laughs> Do I go along with this and then try and turn them in? No, we're going along with it now. Come on. I take the money. We're gonna take the money, damn it. Alright, both both of the hive minds in the court. We're going along. We're we're Lethal here. free calling the uh the decisions. Otherwise we're gonna work as a night guard for the rest of our lives. Come on. It's Studying game theory. Difficult choices. So much for the quiet night. Holy night. 
Mm. I think you need to tell me what we're doing here. Nerve going already? I'd just like to be prepared, that's all. A very powerful Chinese clan called the Choi's are here tonight to reacquire a porcelain ball that has been in the possession of their family for over a thousand years. Reacquire? What went wrong? A careless business transaction. So we're here to help them get it back. We're An ancient Chinese secret, huh? I presume you're not buying it. What do you think? Great. You know, I gave up stealing a long time ago. To do what? To study. Then tonight's your lucky night. How do you work that out? Because the only thing studying will get you is unemployment. Hey, it said how come, but she said... There's some editorializing here. <laughs> We're stealing from people who are prepared to... It's nice races. how quickly we can make a connection with the Chinese business well, person and her... Tonight I am. You know. First one prospects. Okay. Great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess you could see it that way. You know, maybe you got a point I didn't even click the button. These people have That's just what he did. Well done, Grandma. We willed it that way. <laughs> of course, our neck was broken by that musical edit. The second part of the auction has just begun. Thank you. <laughs> Nine ten to my left. Thank you, sir. Nine ten. Nine twenty. All right, JG. Whatever we're doing next, Nine you're getting. Nine twenty. Thank you. Now, Alamand, right. Nine thirty. Again to my left. Nine forty. Do I hear nine forty? Nine forty. Thank you, sir. Looking for nine fifty. Nine fifty to my left. Do I hear nine sixty? Fair warning. I'm selling. Nine fifty once. Nine fifty twice. So for nine hundred fifty thousand pounds, this. Marvelous 12th century cabinet. Pretty heavy ball. Hidden compartment, which is 150 grand for its time. Just Thank try to keep it powder dry. Oh, I'm sorry. If I had that kind of money, I wouldn't spend it on a fucking sideboard. <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> to what I feel Margaret Dumont is stunned by our course words. Lot 247. And to introduce it, first, I'd like to pass you over to our expert, Miss Katie Tran. Katie. It's a small, small portion of unobtainium. What we have here is an absolutely exquisite example. He sneezes, drops it. Of late I was just thinking that. <laughs> One of only three beautiful pieces remaining here. examples okay, great. of the red done. phoenix pattern Simon. known to be in existence. Sebastian, mm. if you would please. Thank you very much indeed, Katie. It like is. to think that's just a five dollar piece, piece of like you know thrift china cannot be passed you think they got a real ming dynasty vase for this uh game samuel pa who is i mean look at those costumes i mean they're superb do we think they did or not yes no the sale proceeds to the chinese art restoration fund you can't afford it what did we say about not talking and so we should begin the selling Thank you, Katie. Thank you, Sebastian. And I would like to start the bidding, please, at two million pounds. Bid, two bid. Million. Oh, it's not the choice. Thank Sorry. you, madam. Two million I have to my left. Three I'm looking for. Do I hear three? Three at the back. Thank you, sir. Do I hear four? Four. Four to the lady. Thank you, madam. Four I'm bid. Do I hear Why five? What the fuck are you doing? Five I'm looking for. Thank the you, Richard, on the phone. Five I have. Do I hear six? Six, I'm looking for. Six to my right. Thank you, sir. How powerful did you say these toys are? Do I now hear seven? Seven, I have to the lady. Please Thank you, stop bidding. Seven. Do I hear eight? Eight, I'm looking for. Eight, I don't understand how it is we're helping for these nine. other people Why buy it. What are we doing, Gigi? Do I hear nine? Better. Nine in the room? She's got pretty, they're not. Nine, I'm looking for. Yeah, but they're but she's pretty nine and they are no longer the in the room with the gun have. pointed at us. I'm looking for nine five, ladies and gentlemen. Nine five. Nine five. Nine five to my right. So do I hear ten? Matt, stop this. Don't talk to him, talk to me. We're looking to break ten. Thank you, madam. <laughs> ten we have. We are at eight. Eight. A choice room, there. Ladies and gentlemen. I was saying now we stop seven. her. We've got to hit the sweet spot. You now, sir. So do Our I superior hear? knowledge of Ming vase prizes will aid us here. 
ten five I have. Thank you. Now do I hear eleven? Eleven I have with the lady. I'm gonna have Again, a hard thank time. you, madam. Eleven, it's your bid, madam. Yeah, gut feeling. Eleven, okay. so because you know price. We have eleven five. Logarithmic curve, derivative. Eleven five. <laughs> Bit, Stuff that sounds like it means something, but doesn't really. Trust me. Eleven five. Eleven five. I have. Thank you very much, sir. Eleven There's five. No it's your bid. It's against you now, man. It's against you, sir. Eleven five. Eleven five. With you, sir. Fair warning. I'm selling. Weevil. Eleven five once. <laughs> Intervene. Don't let her this time. A math man says no. So. To the gentleman on my right for eleven and a half million. Yeah, we have magic math power, so we know the right amount. I guess we'll never know, will we? Come on. We'll be fine. Not unless we start over from the beginning and make another choice. This game's hard. You never had your hand in the dirt. Get out of these your your fucking probabilities. Once you've made a choice in this game, you can never make the other choice. It's programmed that way. You'd have to wipe your hard drive and install a new copy of the game. All right, where to? The basement. Jeffrey's going to call the lift from downstairs. Okay, and then? Then you're going to take out the security guard. <laughs> I'm sorry. To dinner. You, you didn't want to tell me that earlier? Follow Jeffrey's instructions, darling. Just like you did when you stopped my bidding. So what do I do? Well, but I didn't stop well, him right away. I mean, logarithmic out. curves and all. Lee, uh... <laughs> 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 dead in his tracks. tracks. JJ. Uh, prevent. Oh, I didn't actually note what the choice was. Yeah, because you're too busy fucking circle jerking the air. <laughs> or I could take this lift up to a higher floor and maybe warn one of the employees. Or go up to the roof and maybe try and escape from there. Lethal. Down to Goblin Town. Down. Out of all of the probabilities, how did I end up here? Yeah, what was our percentage chance of that? What a Large. stupid choice. <laughs> Why did we talk over that one decision point? You did well. Stop emailing like that. Don't know what got into her. Follow me. Just seems to like the rush. You don't say. Okay, the assistant's packing up. You've got to move right now. Wait here. When Simon gives the word, move out to the middle of the corridor and wait for the guard to come to you. Just say you got lost looking for the box. What? Simon. Please, the guard's image. He's not going to believe that. I'll handle that. Simon likes to do draw rings, by the way. Yeah. Stealth Ready? mission, JJ. CQC, remember your training. Alert the guard or let this play out. He will not remember. Not get another chance. 20 minute codec calls between everything. This is yours, JJ. Go. Play along. Okay, Matt, go. Stop right there, sir. This is a <laughs> oh, I've, I've got What's a going on? Respond! No, it's floor staff only. Oh, I was, uh, what? I was looking for the toilet. No, you wouldn't have come down here unless you meant to. <gasps> no one has ever pressed the wrong button before. That syringe was meant for Matt. All right, lethal. We got in another situation. Do, <laughs> do it. Hold on. It's all, but that's my trolley, sir. No, you, you can't have this one. It's mine. So your defense when you're charged with like being part of this conspiracy is, all I did was grab a t trolley to allow him to choke the guy to death. I was just trying to get out of there. Trolley man was in my way. That was, was being just coerced. following orders. He, he yeah, felt as if he had no other option. <laughs> I'm sorry, officer. I didn't know what the choice was. I was talking over it, so I just chose one randomly. He's fine. Just a, just a little fix it. It'll be it's fine. Gonna be fine. Can't we just keep that in the thing? Do we really have to bring it out of that cushion container? Seems inadvisable. What's a logarithmic curve on the chances that that thing breaks before the story's over? Well, It'll be fine. It'll be, it perhaps may fine. fall up to your We're choice, JK. Okay. Why? <laughs> We're launching a nuclear missile. Enter the, the right. Correct. 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 Got it. Now both hit enter at the same time. Okay. Three. 
There's no way you could do this unless you, you know, used both your left and right hands and stood between them. Got it, we're in. Arms back. Yeah. Also, I'd probably get that That's wrong right. myself in real life. Like, what was that number? <laughs> what? I, I was talking over your just, I'm sorry. Wait, so we're not driving now? What the hell? No, no, we're not the driver. They just needed another body. They didn't have a gun. So, <sighs> We, we had the best trolley grabber in the biz, but he fell 50 feet and broke his arm. They needed us to distract a guard, wink, and then uh, hold down someone's hand from overbidding. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna ruin- well, he's in the beamer, she's in the larger SUV beamer. Oh, I did not expect this to go that smoothly. Yeah. <laughs> but that's why I decided to risk my personal liberty with this criminal enterprise. I expected it to be a shit Lethal. show. I five, damn it! <laughs> Don't leave her hanging. Bam. That's rude. I have to admit, I wouldn't have thought you'd live up to the task. Oh, thanks, I guess. And as far as I can see, you're beginning to like playing this game. How are the police already on site? JJ. Right. Yes. I love. Which is on the shit. left. <laughs> right was on the left. That was total cocky. It's a matter of perspective. It's his right. Okay. Good point. <laughs> It was faithless. <laughs> Alright, where is the rest of the action in this uh, BMW commercial? I can't help but wondering what happened to the blonde lady. It's like one of those holiday car commercials. You're right, Lethal. Well, we have it. <laughs> like, fuck for that. Toyota Glad we have this giant van for this bowl. White guys, good luck with the escape. Right. Bye. Bye, vehicles that we stole. Nothing there. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back in society. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna do that rando. Let me see it. I want to see the bolt. Just wait. This thing stays in the bag until it gets to Woo's place and he turns it into money. Too fucking right. Bloody well right to say. Shortage High Street. Hong Kong City restaurant. Take South a left or don't. What are we going to do about this comedian? Give him to me. I'll pop. Whoa, hold on. Not here. Just keep him quiet until we get rid of this bowl. Jeffrey, you're not serious. There should be some gaffer tape in the back somewhere. Look out! Oh, you didn't even have to lie your way out of okay. getting murdered. All right, Lethal. <laughs> Whatever's happening next is on you. All right. Smoke on the water. <laughs> succumb or don't succumb? <laughs> Mate. Six days of sacrifice, so you have to Mate, actually Link. die. Mate, can you hear me? Open your Are eyes. Are you filming near you? Okay, there's petrol. Look, we've got to get out. Right? And there's petrols. Fuck. But is the vase okay? For some reason, I thought we crashed into a body of water. I guess that was not the case. No, it was a vehicle. Head on. We didn't go off the bridge. That we, we, we crashed into water and completely displaced it with the force of our landing. Damn. Don't put your hand on the glass. <laughs> Choose. Put your hand on the glass. Don't put your hand on the glass. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, they're a lost cause. Their, uh, their legs are totally busted. They, out they, anyway. also, they had also basically decided they were going to murder you, so fuck them. Yes, fuck them. Yeah. Fuck them. Don't fuck them. Apparently, we're the only ones who are not distressed by the uh, the crash. We're perfectly fine. We're, we're already in shock over everything that's happened. We've been through a lot. We're just we're just moving. Behold, the ultimate bowl. Oh shit! We need to get away from here. I'm tired. Where are we going? We're taking this bowl to Mexico. Mexico. Woo! Take this uh, bolt to to finish what you we're gonna go to see Santucci. Yeah, well, that was the plan, wasn't it? We're getting our goddamn money. I'm not gonna work as a valet forever, damn it. 
you to stay. Mei get the fuck up! Mei Ling! Man, she suddenly turned into one of those girls who, like, turns a heel running away from the monster. JJ! Convince her! <laughs> she's pretty, I wanna save her. Look at me. You can't also, she's probably a better out. angle to talk to Wu than just yeah. some random asshole. Good point. Take her. Take, 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 take. Considering that we don't know who Wu is. She fucking knows. Wait, you can't leave that bag there. Well, you, I suppose he took it and put it in his pocket. Okay. <laughs> this random asshole's on the street. Don't mind us. Yep. We're just wandering away from the crash. Don't don't uh, ask us anything. I mean, we don't look like we've been in a crash. She just literally did twist her ankle. Really? She's fine. Really, considering how they're walking away from this, JG, and that's your fucking problem, I can't believe she twisted her. No, it's it's the girl <laughs> twisting her ankle at the inopportune moment thing. It's, it's hey, yeah, nice. hey it, at least she's wearing, you know, normal shoes for this occasion, not nine-inch heels, okay? Right. She's wearing, like, your normal, like, subterfuge. They look jacket. like... They, they look like they college look... kids who've been out for a night. <laughs> Just yeah, they kind of do. Welcome to Hong Kong City. Table for two. All well, the logarithms we're stay. Here. We're here to see someone. Table for four. Four on me, please. It's going wrong. Excuse me. We uh, we don't want to eat. No, I mean, we do. We maybe. Get the, four on me, please. Let's no, see. No, no. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> we want to see the manager. <laughs> you want to see the manager? <laughs> want to see the manager? You're not even eating. No. Your health inspector? No. Look, is Mr. Wu here? Mr. Wu? Mr. Wu, yeah. Never heard the of Wu. Mr. Wu. <sighs> you obtuse motherfucker. It's this Hong Kong restaurant. You apparently want Taiwan restaurant. You heard of her? Memory careering. Rearing? Really? Who knows? He may be genuine Chinese. Tell Mr. Wu that Mei Ling and Jeffrey are here to see him. You tell him right now, or you can pay the consequences. That's gonna be more okay. than 20 quid, you? mate. Right here. Have fortune cookie. Of oh. nothing. <laughs> Have a fortune cookie, cookie. damn it. <laughs> It'll lead us to our fortunes, probably. The Sierra Adventure game has laced the fortune cookie. <laughs> fortune doesn't come twice. Didn't know any better, so you picked that one on purpose. What does yours say? Well, we're taking one. Take one. <laughs> See, I'm glad you didn't wait for us to answer that one, because you know I, I mean, going. we picked the fortune cookie yeah. bowl. Why <laughs> I can not say no? The best ending can only come when you take fortune okay. cookie, but then don't take fortune cookie. Okay. He's the trash. He didn't tell us. Like it's a shooting star? Tell me. This motherfucker. <laughs> oh, this will be the key in the ending. Like, she's going to kill us, but she won't do it until she knows our fortune, and that's when we get the drama. It probably just says you like Chinese food. I've gotten that one before. This is the man that's popped up in the Choices Matter Achievement Progress. <laughs> I feel like I'm playing Yakuza already. Especially the man walking towards me with a giant meat cleaver. You think he's the secret Korean locker baby? Yes. Matt was actually here 20 some odd years ago. What's your business? We actually just wanted food. I don't know why that guy sent us back here. Behold, the ultimate bowl. I could put soy sauce on that. Why have you brought this here? Because For money. I made no such deal. I have never seen you before. Look, the man who made the deal is dead, okay? That's why we brought you a bowl. My bow. Adam. Turn by Asia over here. Oh, fuck. I thought you knew these people. I wouldn't have cho chosen these choices. It's quite impressive. I assumed all Chinese people knew each other. Is that wrong? JG, whatever's on next is on you. If it's you getting a shot for your racism. We stole this for you. I gave no such order. I was making fun Not of to you or anyone else. What? To steal that bowl is not only madness, it is also suicide. To the Choi family, possession of that bowl is a question of honor. Filial piety, they motherfuckers. They have fought wars for it. 
Its price is Lethal beyond measure. Lethal brow. Where's the choice for me just to slap that thing? Paid for it tonight. And I do not intend to add my life to the bill. Fair point. Now we'll get both just leave. JJ. Believe. I want to believe. What should we do with her? If the choice catch you with it, you are dead. If you destroy it, you are dead. <laughs> I still don't want to just destroy in his office. <laughs> you are dead. Awfully thoughtful of him to just not like take the bowl and like give it to the choice. Huh? Well, apparently, if he gives it to them, they'll think he stole and kill him. Not my. Well, let's problem. go to them and say we found this. Atom. I would just say, you know, leave it, leave it out on the. Oh, Goodbye. play ding dong ditch with it. Go to Choice again. House, leave it there, ring the doorbell, and run. Apu <laughs> optional. Ding dong ditch. Fucking great. Just the idea of a big, steaming filled pile of dog doing that bowl when you're running away. That'll show the choice. <laughs> I still want to know what my fortune cookie says. <laughs> sure. Well, I'm not going to tell you. Tell her, don't tell her. A young man may trust his ears, but a wise man trusts his heart. I wonder if this is a quantum cookie that depend changes depending on your choices. You know I choice? thought wisdom and heart were opposed in the liberal it. crime squad universe. <laughs> fucking that may be adjacent to this universe. You knew. Yes, this is part of the bolts. liberal crime squad <laughs> extended this universe. <laughs> this doesn't really help us, does it? It was the choice that ran us off the road. We need a plan. Look, you're assuming because they're bad drivers, they were Asians. I hate you for that. No, I was just saying you assumed they ran off the road. Maybe you just ran into some people. Better plan. No. No, we go to the police, Mei Ling. Like we should have done in the first. That's place. a better plan. It's a stupid plan. I actually I think I heard better. Probably better. Well, it's better than hiding away from the inevitable. Look, we need to get rid of this bowl before the choice get rid of us. If we take it to the police, they will arrest us. Not for definite, no. Why I'll can't we just throw it into the same. river? <laughs> your calculations and my gut are doing exactly the same thing. Why not play ding dong ditch at the police station? Leave the them. bowl at the police station <laughs> door, ring the door, and run. Don't show those police. <laughs> yeah and rational mathematical algorithms. Well, my gut feelings are based on experience and my entire subconscious. Do you know how oh, entire. the brain's activity are conscious? Probably less than one. Now that's a percentage. So that's trust me when I tell you that going to the police is a bad idea. Probably less than one is not actually a percentage. Follow her. Follow yeah, her, Dan. Follow her. She's got a much more interesting plan, at least. All right, let's go. What is going to the police ever put paid off in a video game like this, right? <laughs> I can't think of an example. Only well, if you are the thing police. that popped to mind. Oh, you went to the police. Oh, but you, you, your mind's been fucked, and you, you've been framed for everything. Uh, yeah, that's a good one. Or maybe, maybe it works out for you somewhere in the police quest series. <laughs> Go to police. You forgot to put on your utility belt. You are now more <laughs> version car marshal. Well, in Deja Vu, eventually you go to the police, but only after you've all fed right. an alligator all the other evidence. All right. <laughs> Mr. Woe there's popped up for achievement progress. Choices matter 7 out of 14. We might be halfway One through this adventure. Name. Maybe. Snake? What's well, been possible from jump that we were halfway through the adventure? I panicked. There was a 33.3 .3 repeating, of course, percentage chance of panicking in the interaction. Uh -huh. uh, my scale says me, instead of calling ourselves Smith, we should have said our name was Santucci. We should have called up my expert JG to do the voice. The telly. We know they're in the UK now. Did you believe Wu? They knew nothing about the job. Why do they keep spelling woo w o e? It's doing. all right, JG. Let him do it. Do not become furious. No, I didn't watch this conversation, mate. I don't know. 
I thought we were delivering the ball for 20% job done. I should be back at home by now, soaking in the bath. Mm-hmm. Shit. What? There's no bath. Somebody must want this thing. <laughs> no! Why has no one tried to contact us? <laughs> they don't have your contact <laughs> info! Phone messages. Or, or, or what about that place in Chelsea? Maybe they've tried to contact us there. Just shut up, could you? He's got a really good idea there. So I broadly am thinking, depending on how the very first choice goes, you're either romancing an Asian girl or a blonde girl. Let's kiss. Why the fuck not? Trust her gut. There you go. I don't think it's his gut that's telling him to kiss her. JG. <laughs> Star-crossed lovers and she, but he did it for the itchy. <laughs> Shareholder lethal gets results. <laughs> Hospitalization of shit. That's us. A Chinese porcelain bowl, which had just been auctioned for the reported value of 10 million. Actually, dollars. it was. The criminals left the location in two high performance sports cars and subsequently disappeared. Though an it was really cool. The third vehicle, which occurred 20 minutes later, beneath this flyover near Shepherd's Bush, is also thought to be linked to the robbery. How the hell do they know that? An explosion which completely destroyed the vehicle. Choice will believe the ball's history. He'll choice the worst. I am deeply, deeply devastated by this event. If the ball was indeed destroyed, the transcends value. Oh, yeah, I'm very the compassionate of him. This story may also be linked to the murder of Anthony Wu, a Chinese uh -huh. restaurant owner with uh -huh. connections to the criminal underworld. Well, <laughs> that didn't take long. You had no connections to the underworld. Just like lightning weird. fast, they already put that shit on the news. Maybe he just killed himself to just be along the process. Jesus. He actually died of food poisoning. It's a complete coincidence. <laughs> but it was murder as food poisoning, according to the news. JG. Ask. Why? What's wrong? <laughs> it's a fake. What the hell is it? It's got the wrong symbol on the back. <laughs> it's a middle finger underneath it. Damn it! <laughs> Keep smudging it for sure. Uh, Mr. Smith? Yeah? I have some people in the reception. Shall I send them up? Oh, I've seen this in Yakuza too. <laughs> well. Alright, Lethal is prepared for whatever comes next. Uh, open the window. <laughs> we are not going downstairs. This guy's not cure you. Breaking it, yeah? Breaking I'll it. Stay. <laughs> was JG. That was his pick. And he's like, yeah, we're fucking breaking it. So we're fucking breaking it. Oh shit. This seems like a poorly done idea, but hey. It apparently worked. Yeah. But not breaking it, but. Yeah, it looked like all he had to do is lift up the damn. I mean, handle. you broke the fucking window. What the fuck? That's factually correct. And you guys are like, you're supposed to smash the glass. <laughs> But every time I open a door, I don't say, I broke the door, see? Yeah. Don't do that. Because you don't <laughs> smash the hand. Oh. Give me the ball. Bye, Paul. How do you know I that? don't want to hear. Trust. Trust me. Please. Yeah. All right. I'm holding the hand. Go get it. Come on. Oh, shit. <laughs> Matt. Now they're going <laughs> to kill us. <laughs> Extra dead. Well, damn it. Well, well, fuck that ball. That was a decoy bowl. Did I have a real bowl like, here. Slow down. Oh, slow slow down. You're not going fast enough. <laughs> After everything we've been through tonight, you destroy the bowl just like that. Just stop, will you? It wasn't really the bowl. They're gonna fucking kill us. It's not that simple. Yeah, with you, it never. We're all gonna kill us. Just stop. I can explain. Inside. <laughs> Inside this particular tunnel. You destroyed the one thing that was keeping us alive. The one thing! Math man, please. Do, do not become furious. It's total madness, tell me why. Math man. He's fleeing from Mr. Glitch. I am an exiled Choi daughter. Because it was a fake. A fake! So what? The ball was fake. Then where's the real one? I don't know. Rich white dude on the TV still has it. Fake? 
Because I'm the one who washed it. <laughs> Fucking K? I guess, I guess, yeah, that would be, uh, that would give her pretty strong indication. And you're telling me this fucking now. Come back and trade it for our lives. But I need your help to get it. Please. We're gonna need to recruit some more guys and plan a heist from scratch. Oh, I'm sorry, am I hearing you right now? JJ? Yeah, trust her. Okay. We've come this far. Okay, but these are my conditions. <laughs> Firstly, First. you tell me everything you know. The whole story. And if I find out you've left out even the slightest detail, I am I'll be really gone. cross. Secondly, from now on, we do things my way. <laughs> With our fire. <laughs> Let's fucking get him. <laughs> Agreed. He's just some valet motherfucker. We're doing things my way. Mm. Let's start talking. Yeah. I needed the money. Yeah. We all? Yeah. Who paid you? Samuel Pa. Mm. Am I supposed to know who that is? Yes, we've he seen him multiple times. The TV. Guy who was he selling the bowl. With it, but he mm -hmm. knew the choice would never let him keep it. Okay. So he had you forge a copy to sell to the choice. To keep for himself. He didn't believe that. So much. why did you save the rob? Oh, so that got yeah. I believe in the good in people. Oh, don't give me this bullshit. <laughs> Where's the original now? I don't know. Lethal? Believe, why the fuck not? I can see Palm must somehow be involved. But why the theft if he could just sell the copy? He couldn't just sell it. At the Hainsworth, they would have found out. Look, you can paint it perfect all you like, but you just can't fake the age of porcelain. Dating is based on an effect called thermoluminescence. It's Both science. Leave up blinks. What? <laughs> so she's a grandmaster forger. Like that's what she. <laughs> okay, of course. You mean? I don't know. You tell me. Oh my god. If the forgery was retrieved from the van after the accident, it would have been indiscernible from the original. After the accident. It was no accident, was it? So Mr. Parr set you up to get killed. Gotcha. Okay. Come on. Let's get out of here. All part of his elaborate scheme. Are we, are we just gonna bust into some incredibly wealthy dudes? Like, fucking... I won't let him get away with it. Excuse it's me? It's a video game. It's a video game, man. We might have to, like, beat up some guards along the way with the uh, ninja skills, but yeah, we'll do it. Get me my sweet beamer. There's one now. Oh, wait. Yeah, let's pretend sure they're not flashing those at us. It's, it must be someone further down. We don't really have yes, those guys. All right, Lethal, whatever's next is up to you. It's in a situation like this, you best to smack at the biggest guy right in the face before he does. Come on. You didn't believe that. Hey, you. Let's fight. Fuck off. Keep your hands off me. Just some old boy looking for a fight. JJ? Fight. All right. Fight. River City Ransom right here. <laughs> Math man said he wanted to smack a bitch. Let's smack a bitch. I'm going, Matt. I told you to fuck off, yeah? What big don't you understand? It's going better than I expected. I know, right? Of course, there's cops watching. I expected this champ to just, like, take us to, you know, on one of those bollards. I guess we've been separated from Master Forger Lady. Oh yeah, she said she was leaving. Yeah. Right, bye. Yeah, where the hell are you? Luckily, we had added her to our phone during all this. Return the ball where the girl dies. Music. Oh, well, that solves all of our problems. Go to the police and tell them that some girl's being murdered. No choice. No choice? What kind of game have... is this? I know. Do we have any... Other than the... I mean, other than... All, all the other choices invested her in, invested us in the girl. No. She says Paul's fucked us. So let's pay this guy a visit. So these are the choices we've had. We're invested in her now, instead of just saying yeet. Hey, I'm not invested. He's shareholder lethal. Fucking excuse me? <laughs> You've invested. I am just, uh, you know, 
just like showed up at the shareholders feeding uninvited and nobody noticed. Oh, and you just raised your goddamn placard to bid, huh? <laughs> Well, well, actually, actually, I, I made the person next to me stop. He looks the way I feel time. right now. <laughs> it kind of feels like they'd shot themselves a movie and then realized, oh crap, we don't really have any way to distribute this. Let's shoot a few extra versions of scenes and make it a choice-based video game. How dare you like be how disrespectful of FMV games? That was kind of a compliment. Like, it looked good enough to be a movie. Disrespect is whatever. What's that lethal? Okay. What's, What's up? it disrespectful <laughs> or not? You, you, <laughs> you were going to say something lethal. <laughs> what happened? I forgot what I was going to say. That's what happened. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't important enough to remember. Yeah, say it. Get don't this man say another it. scotch. <laughs> It's downstairs, and I'm not getting up. The point with Mr. Samuel Parr? Mr. Parr does not receive guests before 10 o'clock. I want to see him, and I want to see him right now. Oh, well. Wait here. Well, normally everybody Mr. says Parr. that. <laughs> Mr. Yeah. Parr, this man says oh, that he has thank you. Well, uh, I'll take my tea in the study today. And uh, bring up a scotch as well. For shareholder lethal. Are you intrude at the crack of dawn, my friend. I assume it's urgent. I want the original. The original of what? You know what I'm talking about. Do enlighten me. The rice bowl. The fucking rice bowl. If you're referring to the rice bowl that was stolen from Hainsworth last night, that piece is gone. Lost forever, I fear. That's not true. Forever. No. Because what was stolen was a copy. The original is safe and in your possession. He says, and no, it's not. And then the choice is, believe him, don't believe him. Well. Mr. Matt. Just Matt, please. Mr. Have Matt was my father. I know the mailing forged a copy for you, and you organized the robbery. And you have proof to back up this outrageous slander? I don't need proof, mate. We're not in court, are we? I okay, I need to take a moment here. Like, saying, like, saying so, like, you don't have any proof of this is like me telling my mom that she doesn't have proof of me lying to her, and me smacking the sh her smacking the shit out of me, because she doesn't need proof! <laughs> <laughs> she knows I'm lying. I mean, he's already established that he's somewhat of a badass, even though he's just some random valet asshole. He just took out some random chaps without any issue. Maybe he is Kiryu. Yeah, but Mr. Mr. Parr may as well hold up a sign saying, yes, I do have the bull. I know what I know, yeah? That you fucked up my life for yeah. a piece of fucking bottle. <laughs> my life. Language you did that. <laughs> no one else. Language. <laughs> He is kind of breaking character with all this language. <laughs> what is this like? Oh, I thought he was going to get a foppish bumper shoot, but he got a golf club instead. Do you have any idea how much that cost? I don't know, mate. Three balls. What is this one? Wait. wait. All right. Sensibly in my study. Where I keep the gun. Yeah. Leave yeah, I, you beat me to that by like a quarter of a second. Viewer <laughs> of these Ming bosses. All right, lethal is lethal is up with whether a high stakes high drink to have. Let me just turn my back to him. <laughs> That's good. In fairness, Mr. Parr it's didn't tell them, "Hey, injure your driver and get this it's asshole it's instead." That's a lie. It's the truth. Intimidate. What do you think the choice have to say about all of this? <laughs> the choice will never believe you. I am a respected member of the community. <laughs> Clearly, I'm the community. Oh yes. JJ, awesome. <laughs> I'm not here. Well, that one's also intimidating. What's the I difference? Don't know where it is. I'm on old man blood. <laughs> that was my I'll choice. Everything in here. Mr. Parr, is everything all right? Uh, it's fine, Ola. Everything is fine. <laughs> Do not. <laughs> Do not ask me. I asked him to break my face. Everything. I need that bowl. People's lives depend on it. I don't think you'd go that far. Neither did I until I got here. Go that far. Where's the line? How far will I go? We're hitting it. Him. Him. <laughs> Bang. You're making a mistake. Bang. Thank you. Are you hitting me right in my mood? Neither of us are leaving here until I get that fucking ball. Back. Oh man. In the name of God. 
It's here, the is here. <laughs> Stop in the name of God. You're embarrassing both of us. <laughs> I clicked at the chest last night. Well, that was uh, easy. Yeah, that was fun. Glad we hit him. Let it. All right, that's the only thing I heard. Yeah, uh, I, I was agreeing. Yep, don't want to so. turn our back to him. But the gun might be in there. This conversation is over. Him. Oh shit! <laughs> the oh is shit! Shoot him! Don't. Well, Fuck I don't you. know who's starting this, but. <laughs> I mean, that motherfucker shot at you. We're not gonna fucking take that. No! How do Don't we find it? But we can't find the vase now. And he got his blood all over. Frenzy achievement. Proficient storyteller achievement. Expert storyteller achievement. A progress on those, though, rather. Achievement. That got it. Now we'll have to shoot Ula, too. But yeah, bloodthirsty lethal. Now we don't know where the vase is. It's in the safe. Shoot her! <laughs> it's in his gun safe. Come here! Come here! Come here, you. I'm gonna make out with you. Your love interest potential number three. <laughs> he was number two. <laughs> we come full circle. <laughs> Less than 12 hours ago, Matt was taken hostage. I was gonna say, say we've come full circle. At the beginning of the game, we were being tied to a chair. All right. Well, the community lost a quality member there. And to think, we, we've killed a man, and it's all because we didn't let that blonde woman have that guy's keys. Yeah, well, where is she, I wonder? Maybe she's like an undercover police officer or something. I'm guessing there's two completely unrelated stories that flow from that decision. Go fuck. Okay, Matt. Go fuck. All right, Matt. Pull yourself together, take a run and boss, and get the fuck out of here. Also, get a new shirt. You might want to change... Hey, deep. Well, that's that's what I got. <laughs> All right, game over. Yeah. Is that fight or no choice in time? The that was no choice. You have it. Okay. Where? You're dying, but the girl can still live. Where is our ball? We must oh. have it. Where? Fuck you. Good answer. Shoot at us. Eventually. Not if she doesn't know. It could be in that delivery. It looks like though that JG wanted to fight option. <laughs> and that looked like a fight to me. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure at this point. Yeah, like I was starting to wonder if it was possible to die because we made some pretty dumb decisions over the course of that. How do you think it's not possible to die? Well, I don't think that now, but we made a lot of calls where it's like, yeah, okay, it doesn't look like we're, we can be dumb enough to die. Uh, and then eventually, you die. I think the game is really trying to steer us towards an interesting story. That's what allows you to do foolhardy choices, because it's like, normally you wouldn't go along with some random operation to be the dude or push your luck to get 20%, but you know, it's funny and interesting. Right. They, they, they wouldn't tell a game of, they wouldn't, like, create a game about some doldrum. And okay. there you well, just I, sat no, there I, in the I car. I get that, but I get that, but like there could be lots of earlier ways to die. It could be like the Sierra version of an FMV. Yes, <laughs> and the group avoided those choices. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, know the blonde woman long enough, a car just randomly slams into your booth. Game over, yeah. <laughs> you don't get the fortune cookie, and as a result, uh, the building collapses on top of you. Frenzy achievement. Pull the trigger. <laughs> the next time we won't go into a bloodthirsty frenzy. Hopefully, there's some sort of continuity like nodes in this, so we don't have to replay the entire game. But I'm prepared if we do. Yeah. The question now is, do we uh, do we attempt to pursue the same path up to that point, or do we decide to give the blonde woman the keys, which I'm guessing leads to a completely different and unrelated story. He died in real life, huh? Not just in the um, video game. Well, continuity brought to you by shareholder lethal and uh, JG. <laughs>
Cheryl <laughs> Lethal and uh, JG. <laughs> <laughs> So, what what I heard from both of those, uh, both of those two viewers, without even me prompting, is that they both wanted to explore this again. <laughs> oh, that was definitely a good way to spend however long we just spent. That was an, fun. an hour. Yeah, no, that was fun. Biggest fighting lad. <laughs> Other fighting lads. This was good. This is spoilers for people we haven't seen. Huh? I was just about to mention that. Bunglers. Third a assistant. A lot of third assistant directors. Second unit director. What the oh, fuck? Man. You're not helping JG's idea that this was oh Ray and Gary uh, that uh that this was all just a movie that they just decided to turn into some FMV interaction. Ray and Gary. This is a lot more cast than I was expecting, but the quality of the FMV again is higher than what I'm used to. I guess I haven't seen a lot of FMV games. This one appears to be well done to me. And uh, from what I'm hearing, it's exceptionally well done compared to some of what's out there. It, it's been a trend that's picked up in the past few yeah. years with uh, Contradiction being the uh, the detective uh, point-and-click adventure game with FMV that's really delightful. And uh, a number of other games also like just follow this like quick-choice interaction. Armor Rural. This is something I hadn't played before, but uh, was in mind to eventually, like, grab. And uh, as it turns out, this is, uh, I feel like this has worked out pretty all right. If, if both these two are sold on, what could happen now? <laughs> what other crazy shit can we get back to? They sure grabbed me by the, you know what? The short hairs. That's yeah. right. I like how JG blames Lethal for romancing me. <laughs> I don't even know what that... When did I do that? What did I say? You know what you did. That's we have a making of producers yeah. and directors. My goodness. I did. I, I joked at one point, oh, hey, she's the third love interest option. And I was abused because I was thinking blonde woman, Asian woman, this woman. But we still jumped in with no. Mr. Parr, the old white man, he was the second love interest. We just shot him in a fit of passion. Mm -hmm. You got the violence that you wanted to get, though, JJ. You are like, fucking hit him. got that old man blood I was looking for. How about that, though? The gun being in the safe. Ah. That's where guns tend to be. <laughs> and it sounded like perhaps that delivery that arrived there at the end after, as Matt was dying, yeah. could very well have been the bull. That was going to be the fucking bull. <laughs> There's the no way. But we were, I, I would imagine we were like, I'm guessing, obviously, but I feel like we were two choices that don't get you killed, or rather just making any choice and not running out of time away from getting the ball and potentially winning the game. In that case, I didn't get to a choice in time, but since you wanted to fight anyway, it doesn't, I don't think Matt was winning that exchange. No, nah. I, I have a feeling that was the wrong choice, but again, like <laughs> it was it was a it was a quick choice. It was, well, well, yeah. Yeah, but... Uh, the rendering and then having the delivery arrive right when it did was probably like the God in the machine saves your ass ending. I was gonna say, they they seemed like they were uh, in the mood to talk. Like, we didn't have to fight there. If we surrendered, we may have had some survival options. Yeah, as the bowl gets Who delivered. Who knows? But yeah, uh, three dudes busted in with guns. They're probably better, like, in the mindset. And we are, yeah. Perhaps better trained with firearms. Your decisions are you, viewers. Hey, we beat an old man who tried to get the jump on us with a firearm, so... Okay. Yeah, we, we were fairly really close. We, we oh, one of we, seven endings, so we, I'm thinking probably yeah, there weren't that many ways to, to get killed. Well, only, no, what you know. probably happens there is that you die, but that's not actually, like, an ending, so it, like, cycles you back to the choice. So I've seen that before in other FMV games where they don't actually have a full thing play out like that. Gotcha, so we got far enough... We could have died like an idiot earlier, but that, that death was a full-on ending death, possibly even an achievement death. We found nine of the 14 chapters. Where are the other five chapters? I can't count that. Huh? <laughs> we made 39 decisions. And no, that doesn't like cycle us to like a timeline. This isn't what, like the Detroit Become Human game lethal, where you can get a timeline. I think so. If you go back one screen there, 
because your decisions or whatever it was. Yeah. Shout out to Betty White and the um, you know auction hall scene there to the left of our our protagonist. Rip the BW. Her last roll. R.I.P. Her last roll, huh? <laughs> All right. I love Betty White. Close the video on that, Grandma, please. <laughs>